Hello, my name is Christopher Wong and I'm a Senior Applications Engineer with Avago Technologies in San Jose, California. Today we're at OFC 2013 in Anaheim and we're going to be introducing you to our newest module in our portfolio, the CFP2 uh, SR. Let's take a look. This is our CFP2 short reach 100 gigabits per second optical module. Uh, each channel operates at 10.3125 gigabits per second so over 100 gigabits per second in aggregate. It uses our 850 nanometer VIXEL array and also uses a 24 fiber MTP MPO connection. Um, it could go up to 100 meters of OM3 fiber or up to 150 meters of OM4. It's compliant to the CFP2 MSA for the mechanical and the low speed. And for the electrical high speed and the optical high speed, it's compliant to the 802.3 BA 100 G base SR10. There's actually a CDR within the device, so when we turn the CDR on, it's actually compliant to the CAUI interface, and when the CDR is bypassed, it's actually compliant to the CPPI. The good thing about also having the CDR within this device is that it allows the user to have two types of loopbacks, one to the host side and one to the optical side. The CDR could also be turned on in order to compensate for the trace lengths and reset the jitter budget or completely bypass in order to save power. So in today's demonstration, we're actually using this Vitesse reference board. It's the VSC7227. And what it's doing is it's actually driving me 10 channels of PRBS31 through an Avago Technology CSP um, transceiver. So this is our AFBR 83 PDZ transceiver. We're using the output of this transceiver to go through 100 meters of OM3 fiber. This is Corning bend and sensitive fiber to our CFP2 module. Now, as you can see, all these different um, SMA cables are, are giving me an electrical loopback and so it's being electrical loopbacked to the CFP2 transceiver and it's being driven back to the CXP. So that's the physical setup of our demo. So essentially, we're, at, we're using the equivalent of two lengths of 100, 100 meters of OM3 fiber, plus we're using the electrical loopbacks and so there's trace lengths and, and cable losses here as well. And what we're gonna show you next is that this demo is actually error free. So the Vitesse reference guide actually allows us to use 12 channels. Um, the CFP2 module is only a 10 channel device. So as you can see, the middle 10 channels are looped back and are actually error free. So all 10 middle channels for the CFP2 are synced up and this is the bit error rate count and they're all zero. And then on this screen, you can actually show that the bit error rate is, is zero. And so this is an error free link. It's the equivalent of, of 200 meters of OM3 fiber. This device could also do 150 meters of OM4. The CFP2 module is very feature rich. It gives the user the ability to go and monitor the output power, the receiver input power, um, the voltage, the temperature, and has numerous alarms like the LOS. So that's the demonstration of the newest CFP2 SR module from Avago Technologies. For more information, you'll want to contact your representative or visit us at avagotech.com slash fiber. Thank you.